right, welcome to the weekly update. You've got Mark Cassell here with the rest of the retail team. We've got an action-packed episode for you guys, obviously covering a few trades as well as something in the news as well. Uh, we're going to go over the single-tenant trades first and then the multi-tenant trades. First, we've got a McDonald's out in Houston that uh, actually traded off the I-10, which is about 3,100 square feet. Sold for 2.7 million at a 4.43% cap rate. And then out in Georgia, we had an O'Reilly Auto Parts that one had seven years remaining on a corporate guaranteed triple net lease. Traded for 1.2 million at a 677 cap uh, with three five year options and 6% increases at each of those options. Some great single tenant net lease trades there. For multi tenant retail, we did have a trade. It was shops at Casa Grand. Total square footage is about 20,200, a little bit north of that. Trade at 3.2 million at 158 square foot. Property was 89% occupied at the time, so it reflects 7.95 cap rate. And on the news side, uh, last week Starbucks did send out a letter to all of their corporate landlords asking for up to about a year of deferred rent. Um, and they're expecting to have 90% of their stores open in the next couple of weeks. And that is it for this week's weekly update. Again, we are the Leveros Retail Team. Thank you so much for tuning in. You can follow us on Instagram and LinkedIn at the Leveros Retail Team. Thank you. Take care. Thank you.